So today I will show how to do transient structure analysis of a beam in Ions workbench. If you see uh, a, a cantilever beam which is loaded at tip uh, with a variation of loads 1000 to 3000 newton and the length is 150 and the diameter is 10 mm and we will check the same in Ions workbench. Go to transient structural drag like this. Then leave engineering data, default it takes structural steel. Then right click geometry, new design modular. First you need to do is chain to millimeters because the length has given in millimeter. Sketching line, try a line, horizontal, dimension, general, select and drag like this. 150 then general select this one this one this vertex which is 75 exact like middle uh, now line has been committed we will give cross section to this concept line from sketches select this line apply generate concept cross section circular 5 mm radius 10 mm diameter concept generate then go to line body select this one and add at here generate you want to see this in 3d or section solid view exit from here now our 3d has been moved kick shells cross section then all the settings give four steps because four steps 0 0.0 0 0.1 0 0.3 0 0.4 uh, current steps is one then in time should be 0 0.1 0 0.1 give all this 0 0.1 now go to second step by clicking second then it should be ended 0.2. This all should be 0 0.1. Now go to the third, third step. It should be ended 0 0.3. For all this 0 0.1. Then last step, fourth step end at 0 0.4 0 0.1 for all this three because maximum minimum time we are giving 0 0.1 so now analysis setting is completed insert insert picture support at here Select this vertex, apply. Then should be the force. This vertex in y direction. Components by tabular time here at zero point one y direction minus 1000 newton then at here minus 2000 then at here minus 3000 so force force are given now we will check the results and see pick the support and pull this then we give the results total deformation we want and we need a beam tool which is having stresses <laughs> then solve
may take some time because you are given the time. So our results are generated. See if you, you want to check with the formula, you can check. We are getting maximum is 33.123, which is load of uh, 3000 Newton. You can see the deformation, which is along y direction. Then you want to see the direct stress. You can see the direct stress here. 12.49 megapascal and combined stress, maximum combined stress. So, this is how we need to perform the transient structure analysis by varying the loads. So thank you. That's our conclusion.